Cats are introverted creatures. They may stroll around with an I don't care attitude around you, but the truth is their inside is much fluffier than their exterior. You may be hurting their feelings through minor misdeeds that might not seem like anything to you. So hello and welcome back to Top Notch. Today, we educate ourselves with the subtle rules we need to follow while petting these cute friends. Before we begin, please take a note to like and subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell so you never miss out on any of our future videos. Done? Well then, let's begin. Number 1. Changing their dietary habits Cats catch habits quickly. They get attached to the taste of what you frequently offer them to eat, and they will expect you to treat them with that certain brand of food for the rest of their life. But if you break the momentum, it may affect the emotional and, in severe cases, physical health of your pet. On an odd day, you may find it hard to buy your pet food from the exact brand, and unbeknownst to you, it actually is stressing the feline out. They might turn away and not accept the food, hence you might need a professional's advice when you shift from one diet to another. Number 2. Hollering them for things they hate No matter how much they feel aloof to you, your cat gets excited when you call them. An exhilarated them will rush to you at once. They will never expect the climax, rather feel all the protection. However, if on the other side, you are waiting with something that the cat hates, it will be hurting your feline. It will take it as a dupe. They hate being forced into situations they don't like, especially at the hands of someone they trust. Number 3. Playful Teasing Yes, you are emotionally hurting them when you pull pranks on them. It might be joyful to you to startle them and throw them in the air to catch them back, but it definitely does not please your friend, even to a micro level. They do not like being treated like a human toddler. They won't go one chuckling at your teasing. Rather, it annoys them, and they might even register you as a toxic owner. The result? They'll flee away as soon as they get the chance. Number 4. Deserting Cats don't necessarily go around licking your body and expressing their love, unlike a dog but they absolutely need your attention. They need frequent reassurance from their owner that they are valued and loved. However, if you are deeply invested in your professional or personal lives, falling deaf to your cat, it can hurt them. This association is the last thing they will ever want from their owner. Hence, when you feel your busy days are arriving, call your friends to attend to your pet while you are away. Another thing that you can do is gently pull them away from your working desk. If they come and disturb you somehow, do not be rash. Give them a gentle touch and shift them to another place. Number 5. Shouting at them Cats are tender-hearted animals. They may not understand human language, but they do decode the expressions. When you shout at them, they take it as a sign that you are a threat to them. Your shouting will not make them learn the lesson, rather they will associate this with negative emotions. They will be reluctant to face you, and this might hurt you in return. So secure your and your pet's mental health and avoid shouting at your beloved feline. Number 6. Punishing Remember that professor who kept punishing you in your school life? Did you ever feel any affliction toward them? No, right? How do you expect your pets to like you when you keep giving them a reason to hate you? Cats and all other animals are incapable of processing complex emotions. Regret is not on their list of emotions, so even if you punish them, they will not learn anything. They are not going to be able to reflect on their wrongdoings like we human beings are able to do. Punishing your cat will only distance them from you. Number 7. Stale Food Not to your surprise, cats are picky when it comes to food. They have their own expectations of the food you offer them. They will hate it if you feed them stale, stinky food. On the other hand, they will appreciate it if you do not let the food sit in their bowl for too long. They love to chew upon fresh food. It can also disturb their bowel. Stale food can disturb their gut and cause food poisoning. The most sensitive organ to stale food is the cat's pancreas. They may catch an infection, so be vigilant about what you feed them. Number 8. Deprived Socializing Who says cats do not need socializing? Their deadpan faces? Well, that makes quite sense. But that is not the case. In reality, they love interacting with other living organisms. It can include their human friends and fellow species as well. If you isolate them within the confines of your cozy flat, it will induce anxiety among them. So, it is healthy for their emotional well-being that you give them enough attention and bring them the opportunity to interact with other pet cats. Number 9. Ignoring their hygiene Cats for sure have royal blood running in their bodies. That is the reason they love giving themselves royal treatment. However, if you do not take care of their body hygiene, it can upset their emotional state. They need you to trim their nails appropriately every now and then. They need frequent grooming from their owners. In addition to this, you need to check their ears from time to time. Their flat ears indicate some sort of infection. 
Likewise, the balls of hair will demonstrate that their stomach is under stress. You should continuously keep a check on your pet and protect them from any potential health issues. Number 10. Intervening their mealtime. Cats need a calm and quiet environment to enjoy and digest their meal. Because their eardrums are far more sensitive to sound waves than us human beings, a moderate noise to your ear can actually irritate them. The intensity of the noise such as your television, a video game, or a piece of music playing in any room, which may seem casual to you, is intolerable to your pet cat. High-pitched noises confuse them and they feel intimidated. They may feel reluctant to eat their food given the noise. Hence, try to keep your TV volume at a justified level that does not disturb your cat during its mealtime. Mental Stimulation Although mental activities aren't what cats look forward to, they enjoy playing with toys and doing stuff that is minimally challenging to their intellect. Hence, you can be a Pablo to your cat and get your little friend's positive response to mind-jolting activities. They may feel a sense of accomplishment when they solve the problems that you offer them, like putting hurdles in their way and pushing them to cross those hurdles to reach you. You can also treat them at the end of the hurdles to reward them. Such activities are not only needed for their physical health, but they also make them happy. Solving such practical riddles will stimulate positive energies in your pet. But be sure not to make it too challenging. The feline won't like it. Number 12. Neglecting their fears. High-pitched voices are their worst phobia. They are intimidated by the noise. It could be any home appliance screeching in a louder pitch. For instance, your cat may feel terror when you are vacuuming your floor. Such sounds literally give them the creeps. They may hide somewhere under the sofa or behind the door when you play loud music. Fireworks are also a nightmare for your cat. You can observe this fear when they have an arched back, flat ears, and lowered tails. Number 13. Forced Socializing Cats are introverts and they have some serious trust issues. They need time before they get attached to a stranger. As an ideal owner, you should allow them to go at their pace and should not force them to interact with others quickly. Gradually, they will make moves on their own and get themselves attached to the newcomer. However, if you force them to interact with your incoming friends in a GIF, you are disrespecting their privacy. We suggest you restrain yourself from such coercion. Otherwise, your cat might act aggressively and cause injury to you or to your incoming friends. So beware. Number 14. Dirty Litter Box their hygienic instinct is not constrained to their body habits, rather they need a clean litter box to defecate their bowel material. They expect you to clean their litter box frequently. It embarrasses them to poop in a dirty box. Number 15. Ignoring the pain. Sometimes it becomes hard for them to pass the stool or urine. They may also feel pain in their gastric region. There are subtle indications that your cat may hint at you, so you can grasp their condition. Their denial to eat their favorite food or frequent hairballs is the depiction that your cat is in pain. They may often vomit when they have a dietary disorder. Such situations must concern you. This is the exact time you should take them to the vet and get their diagnosis. Number 16. Not cleaning their utensils. The emphasis on cleanliness indicates how hygiene conscious this animal is. Not only do they need their nails, ear, and litter box cleaned, but they also expect you to clean their utensils regularly. Your cat expects you to change their water from the bowl daily and offer them clean food. Forcing them to eat and gulp in water from a dirty bowl can pose serious health issues for your pet because these may contain bacteria and other contagious microbes that may affect their inner body system. They may also feel anxious, depressed, and neglected when they are forced to use dirty utensils. Hence, this is a reminder to keep a good check on their hygiene. Number 17. Declawing Declawing your pet, in other words, disrespecting their basic animal rights. Their claws are a part of their body and an asset of pride for them. Cats hunt animals and they love to hunt their prey. For that purpose, claws play a vital role in their life. If you declaw them, it might affect them psychologically. They may feel vulnerable and unable to defend themselves without their claws. It's also painful for these innocent creatures to cut off their claws. Declawing practices make it difficult for the cats to scratch, which is their innate behavior. They may also face mobility issues. When your cat is unable to perform their natural deeds, it may suffer from emotional distress. Number 18. Prolonged Sleep One may assume like humans crave sleeping all day, cats do too. That's not the case. Your pet does not want to snooze all day long while you do your chores. Cats tend to hunt and catch their prey like wild animals. It is their innate need to indulge in such activity. These wild animals have been domesticated for a long time. Now, humans misconceive that their pet does not feel any urge to lurk over their prey and hunt them down. However, one cannot ignore their instinct. It is not easy for them to sit and sleep all day long to pass the time. 
These furry pets need to exercise and indulge themselves in activities that satiate their hunting instinct. At the very least, they will require you to indulge them in mind-stimulating activities, otherwise they may undergo behavioral abnormalities. That's all you need to know about your pet if it has been acting cranky lately. Now that you have enlightened yourself with the crucial psychology of your pet, don't miss hitting the subscribe button and liking the video. And while you're at it, why not share this with your feline-loving buddies? Let us know what kind of information you want to hear in the next video in the comments section below. See you in the next one!